Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I walked into my house today to find my October BoxyCharm waiting for me, so I wanted to open it up as soon as I could with you guys. And I know I have two BoxyCharms in my October videos, and that's because when I initially signed up with BoxyCharm, it was right at the tail end of September. So I ended up getting September's BoxyCharm I think it was at the either at the end of September or at the beginning of October, so I loaded that and I have my regular October box now. So it'll be the only month where I have two boxy charms going on. So I apologize for that. But if you are not familiar with Boxy Charm, it is a monthly beauty subscription box where you get five full-size high-end beauty hair care skincare products for $21 a month and it usually retails for over $100. So let's get into this box and see what's in here this month. I think what I'm going to do this month is flash the value of the product that they put on the card on the screen as I go and then just tell you the total value of the box at the end. I'm just trying to think of a good way to do it to where I don't have to look at the card as I go through and spoil myself for what's in the box. So the first thing that I see in this box is this uh, Briogeo Rosarco Blow Dry Perfection and Heat Protectant Cream. No sulfates, silicones, or parabens. So it looks like this is a blow dry perfection cream, weightless finishing formula infused with rose hip, argon, and coconut oils to smooth hair, enhance shine, tame frizz, and heat protect. Okay, this looks good. So it says it's weightless. I'm anxious to try this out. I've never tried this brand before, and I do have very fine hair, and I'm always looking for decent heat protectants. So I am anxious to see how this works and it is four ounces so that is a good sized product like this already and what's next i'm also not familiar with this brand starlux matte lip paint and that is what this looks like and of course it's wrapped so i gotta get that out so a matte lip paint implies it is like a liquid lipstick so I'm just going to swatch this here. It's going on pretty smoothly. It's kind of a, um, it doesn't seem to be a, a really distinct smell scent to it. So it's kind of a plummy, a warm plummy color. If you look at the color I have on today, this is um, Marc Jacobs Kiss Kiss Bang Bang, which is more of a, I don't know, kind of a muted berry, I guess. And this is more of a warm berry plum in comparison. I guess that's what you call that. So it looks pretty. Let's see if this dries down while I do the video. And next we have Temp2 Shimmer Bronzer. And if I'm not mistaken, Temp2 is the airbrush foundation brand. Is that right? And I am not a big liquid bronzer person. I'm just going to swatch this too. And um, so I, I don't know. We'll, we'll, I'll try this out, but it's very, very smooth and blendable. So there we have that right there. Let's see. I'm going to blend that out a little bit more. So it goes into the skin quite nicely, actually. And I mean, I left, I didn't blend it, blend it, but you can get the idea. So that looks nice. What do we have? Luxie Eye Blender Brush Pack. Brush Pack. Hmm. So there appear to be more than one brush in here. Oh, cute. Okay, I've heard of Lexi brushes, but I'm not familiar with them. So there's three brushes in here, and they're really cute. They're pink with bronze here. So you get three brushes, and they're actually just so cute. Look at these. So they're all blending brushes, three different sizes. You have two tapered blending brushes, number 205 
and number 229 right here and just a little bit different in size the 229 being the bigger and then you have this smaller brush which is just labeled blending brush number 237 so they feel really soft and you know it looks nice because if you have smaller eyes like I do these might work really really well for um, maybe getting in the crease so I'm looking here at my Sigma E40 which is pretty big and I use this a lot for my transition shades so these might be a little more um, tapered for a little bit more precise blending so those are pretty nice they feel good so the last item is in bubble wrap so it means it's probably breakable and it is IBY Beauty 3's Company Trio Eyeshadow Palette. And I need scissors to get this tape. Okay, so it's just a sleek, compact here see what this is and this actually goes perfect with the brushes oh this is really pretty so you have three shades and a mirror here and they're pretty warm excuse my nails guys I'm getting this done um, so you have three warmish neutral shades here and these two seem to be have some shimmer to them and then this one is a matte shade a light highlighting shade, a lid shade, and a crease shade. Really the only thing missing is a transition shade, which you can really get from any palette. And here's the three shades swatched. And they swatched really, really easily. They all felt nice and buttery and smooth. So if you want some warm neutral tones, this would actually be a great portable small palette to use. So I like this box this month i really really enjoyed my second boxy charm just as much if not more than the first so i'm really really pleased with boxy charm so far and i'm going to keep subscribing as long as they keep doing as good of a job as they're doing so thank you so much for watching this video and i hope to see you again and if you haven't hit that subscribe button, please do so today. I thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you again next time. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.